Hey, how's it going, guys? Welcome to CryptoCast, your source for all things cryptid related unknown and paranormal. I'm your host, Parker, and guys, welcome back to another Demon Days. We're going to be talking about different demons. Um, before we get started with this one, uh, this, gave, this research gave me a lot of details, especially of the um, sexual nature. So if you guys aren't into that, I recommend clicking off now. But if you guys don't care, um, definitely keep watching this video. But today, we will be talking about the demon known as Master Leonard. And this is him right here. I'm just going to shrink his picture down just a tiny bit. Um, so if the name Leonard sounds familiar to you, um, you may recognize him from the movie known as The Witch, where he was portrayed as a black goat, which is one of the forms he does take. But let's talk about him first a little bit. So he's depicted as a three-horned goat with a black human face, but he can also take on the form of a human with three horns and a beard, wearing a soldier's uniform and carrying a staff. And we see that image kind of like right here from the Dictionnaire Infernal by Colin DePlancy. Of course, it's, I, it's one of my favorite books. Um, really nice artwork of him. Really good. I like this one. He is known as the master, he's known as the Grand Master of the Nocturnal Orgies, which is very cool. He marks initiates with one of his three horns. Um, he is also the Inspector General of Sorcery, Black Magic, and Witchcraft. He is the Grand Master of the Sabbaths. He is the Chief of the Subaltern Demons. He can allow people to transform into monstrous animals. People kind of believe that maybe this is where, like, the legend of the werewolf kind of stemmed from, um, with Leonard, with Master Leonard allowing these people to turn into um, these creatures like werewolves and other things as well. Um, he can allow men to become incubi. We will be covering incubi and succubi at some point in Demon Days, don't worry. Um... These feasts are held in, in the honor of Master Leonard. They are known as Black Banquets. And this one is kind of a little disturbing. So if you guys are not into... Uh, I just want to give you guys a, a little heads, heads up here. If you guys want to skip ahead um, in the video, that's fine. This is it's a, it's, a little, it's a little gross. So the Black Banquets are said to be thrown in Master Leonard's honor, where, and, where aborted goats are eaten without salt and boiled with reptiles to sully the sinless nature of the clean meat. Now that's why I kind of gave you guys a trigger warning right here because it's a boarded goat and um, I don't know about that, but it's a um, little, little, personally not my cup of tea. Um, and then this is another one, another trigger warning right here. He is said to seduce young women and lie with them, ejaculating cold semen, and any child conceived of this union will be a stillborn as an offering to sin. Um, yeah, so that's there's that as well. Um, he is the demon of witchcraft. Um, that's why I put him as because you've seen if you have seen the movie known as the witch, where he's portrayed as the goat uh, of the same name. It is, it's a decent, not the best, not the worst representation of him. He is portrayed as a black goat. And he did kind of persuade that girl to join the coven of witches, where they pretty much did nocturnal orgies and all that stuff. So they kind of got most of his lore right in that movie. But at the same time, it wasn't exact. So I did put him as the demon of witchcraft because that is one of the main things that he resides over. His personality is stern, wise, and he's also very, very lustful as well, um, which makes sense. As I said, he likes to lie with, he likes to seduce women, lie with them and all that. So he is lustful as well. And he is the grandmaster of nocturnal orgies. So I put that in there as well. Um, and guys, yeah, I couldn't find a sigil for him. I'm not sure what element he is, but that is Master Leonard. So if you guys like this video, be sure that like button, dislike if you dislike it, comment below, guys, let me know what you think of Master Leonard. I think he's pretty cool. Um, 
hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel, become a member of the Crypto Crew, and that bell notification off to the side so you guys know when I upload new videos. Next week, guys, I'm going to try to cover um, Behemoth. So if you guys are looking forward to that again, hit that bell notification off to the side and that subscribe button become a member of the Crypto Crew today. And with that being said, guys, you've been watching CryptoCast. I've been your host, Parker. Um, oh, there we go. Stay spooky, and I will see you guys in the next Demon Days video. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.